The satellite is an artificial object which has been deliberately put into space for different purposes like remote sensing, weather forecasting, image mapping, education and research. India has been successfully launching satellites of various types since 1975. The Indian Space Research Organization ISRO is considered as the sole space agency of India and was formed in 1969 and it has launched various satellites from 1975 till today's date. So hello everyone welcome back to our channel watch with nachos and today we will talk about the famous satellites that India has ever launched. So the first ever satellite that ISRO has ever launched is Aryabhat. It's named after the famous Indian astronomer Aryabhat. It was launched on 19 April 1975 from Kapustin Yar a Soviet rocket launch and using a Cosmos 3M launch vehicle. It was built by ISRO and launched by the Soviet Union. It was built to conduct experiments in X-ray astronomy, aeronautics and solar physics. The spacecraft was a 26-sided polyhedron 1.4 meters in diameter. All faces were covered with solar cells except the top and bottom. The legacy of this satellite can be seen from this as the satellite's image appeared on the reverse of Indian 2 rupee banknotes between 1976 and 1997. Aryabhat weighed 794 pounds, that is 360 kg. The scientific instruments had to be switched off during the fifth day in orbit because of a failure in the satellite's electric power system. Useful information nevertheless was collected during the five days of operation. The second most famous satellite of India is the Mars Orbiter Mission, also called Mangalyaan. It's a space probe orbiting Mars since 24 September 2014. It was launched on 5 November 2013 by the Indian Space Research Organization. It was India's first interplanetary mission and it made ISRO the fourth space agency to achieve Mars orbit. It made India the first Asian nation to reach Martian orbit and the first nation in the world to do so on its maiden attempt. The Mars Orbiter mission probe lifted off from the first launch pad at Satish Dhawan Space Center, located in Sriharikota, Andhra Pradesh, using a PSLV rocket. It spent about a month in Earth orbit till 30 November 2013 and after a 298-day transit to Mars, it was put into Mars orbit on 24 September 2014. The movie Mission Mangal represented the whole journey of the ISRO scientists about how they made this Mangalyaan successful. The third satellite is the IRNSS, the Indian Regional Navigation Satellite System. IRNSS is an independent regional navigation satellite being developed by India. It is designed to provide accurate position information service to users in India as well as the region extending up to 1500 km from its boundary, which is its primary service area. It can provide geospatial positioning information within the Indian subcontinent. It enables users to map out their location, altitude, longitude and latitude. Some other applications of IRNSS are terrestrial, aerial and marine navigation, disaster management, integration with mobile phone and lot others. It's a very useful satellite for India. IRNS system comprises a space segment and a support ground segment. The space segment consists of 8 satellites out of which 3 are in geostationary orbit. The fourth satellite that we are gonna talk about is Saral. The satellite with Argos and Eltica is a joint Indo-French satellite mission for oceanographic studies. Saral performs altimetric measurements designed to study ocean circulation and sea surface elevation. Saral data products will be useful for operational as well as research user communities in many fields like marine meteorology and sea state forecasting. Seasonal forecasting climate monitoring, ocean earth system and climate research. It was launched on 25th Feb 2013 from SDSC Center Sriharikota located in Andhra Pradesh and the launch vehicle used was PSLV. 
And the last satellite for the today's video is the Chandrayaan-1. India's first mission to moon was launched successfully on 22nd October 2008 from SDSC Sri Hari Kota itself. The spacecraft was orbiting around the moon at a height of 100 km from the lunar surface for chemical, mineralogical and photogeological mapping of the moon. After the successful completion of all the major mission objectives, the orbit has been raised to 200 km during May 2009. The satellite made more than 3400 orbits around the moon and the mission was concluded when the communication with the spacecraft was lost. on 29 august 2009 the estimated cost for the project was 386 crore rupees after the successful mission isro launched another mission that was chandrayaan 2 on 22nd july 2019 however the lander crashed when it deviated from its intended trajectory while attempting to land on 6th september 2019 According to a failure analysis report submitted to ISRO, the crash was caused by a software glitch. ISRO will reattempt a landing in 2023 with Chandrayaan-3. So yes, these were the five famous satellites of India all developed and launched by ISRO. That's it for today's topic. Thank you. Namaste.